I actually really like the song. Really, I, I didn't uh, hear it before going here to Holland, but um, an interviewer just played played it for me on uh, their iPad, and then I just heard you uh, rehearse now, mm. and uh, it has this uh, folky American folk mm -hmm. vibe and really nice harmonies, and that's my style, you know. I really, I, I've been in a folk do for many years, so yeah. Yeah. I thought so. Love this song. I thought yeah. so when I heard the song from we last year. I thought it's some country in that girl. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> One, two, three, hit me. Driving in a fast lane, counting my market signs. The empty seat beside me keeps you on the line. Well, like I, like I just said, you know, when I heard yeah. her song last year, I thought. She's in touch with well, the same roots as we are, I think. Mm. Folk, country, bluegrass, you know? Mm. I could yeah. tell. Yeah. And even though I think a wider Eurovision audience probably doesn't notice all these small little details, I yeah. could hear it. Yeah. That's why I love that. Tears on the highway Water in my eyes Enjoy the opportunity. Oh, yeah. That you get the chance of seeing in front of such a big audience because, yeah. I mean, yeah. it doesn't happen every day. No, it's and, right. And of course, you'll be nervous. I was really nervous, mm -hmm. but it's such a big opportunity to get your music out in Absolutely, all of Europe, yeah, so. yeah. <laughs> I could say I'm sorry, but I don't want to lie. I just want to know we stay. Music is not a competition, but since they made one out of it, <laughs> uh, uh, of course we want to win. I mean, everybody wants to win. But um, uh, it's, it's just great to have a platform where we can perform music that we love so much, you know? And that's our, that's our, uh, that's our goal, to do that. Well, we've known each other since we were teenagers, both performing and playing country music. Um, so our roots are definitely in Americana, but um, we both went on to have our quite successful <laughs> solo pop careers and stuff. Mm -hmm. And uh, of course, I always kept an eye on that guy. What's he doing? What's he doing now? And, and then last year, I decided I wanted to have a side project where I could revisit my roots and make a country record in Nashville. So I called up Waylon. I said, do you want to you join me? You know, let's... Uh, Let's make this record together, and luckily he was very positive. So we were in the midst of making that record, and um, we were both individually uh, also asked to participate in the in the contest. And we were debating whether we should, yes or no. And and then when we were making this record together, it seemed so logic to do this as a duo. So um, that's how that came about. There ain't nothing new here in the common. Yeah, more so